high-performance cars are loaded with custom parts for a reason. Efficiency. Installing custom parts that are purpose-built will achieve power more efficiently than the stock parts. Spark plug wires play a critical role in the performance of your engine, but they are often overlooked. Plug wires might not make horsepower, but they can kill performance when they become worn or burnt. To keep your spark plug wires from burning on your headers, a custom-built set of plug wires may be just what the doctor ordered. Building your own wire set will take a little more time, but you can be sure that each wire is the right length and routed correctly for your application. Today, we're going to walk you through the procedure from start to finish. Now before we begin, we need to note that MSD's universal wire sets are supplied with the spark plug terminal and boot installed, so you get a strong factory crimp. Start with one plug wire at a time. Begin by removing the longest stock plug wire from the vehicle and compare it to the longest wire from the MSD Universal Spark Plug Wire Kit. If you're changing the routing of the plug wire, measure the new MSD plug wire on the vehicle. Insert the new MSD plug wire into the mini stripper and crimper tool supplied in the kit. The tool has a stripping guide for two styles of terminals that MSD uses, standard and dual crimp. The dual crimp terminals have two sets of crimp tabs, one for the conductor and one for the sleeve. Two crimps result in a strong connection. Where the standard terminals have crimp tabs at the bottom of the terminal, it also has guides for the 8mm wires on one side and 8.5mm wires on the other side. With the wire end flush with the end of the tool for standard terminals or at the dual crimp mark for dual crimp terminals, Set a razor blade flush with the edge of the strip guide and rotate the wire 360 degrees. Twist the cut end of the plug wire until the sleeve pulls off. A small dab of MSD dielectric grease will ease the installation of the boot. Slide the boot 6 inches down the wire. For the crimper tool to work properly and achieve the strongest crimp possible, bend the crimp tabs on the terminal 90 degrees at the end of the tabs. For standard terminals, such as when using an old-style socket terminal, fold the spiral core back against the wire insulation and slide the terminal over the wire. Position the plug wire until the wire insulation protrudes past the crimp tabs about the width of a nickel. Assemble the crimper over the terminal end and position the tool in a vise with the end of the crimper flush against the jaws of the vise. The next step is to tighten the vise, which causes the crimper tool to crimp the terminal over the wire, creating a secure terminal end. For dual crimp terminals, the procedure is the same, except you have a set of crimp tabs that secure the conductor wire to the terminal. This is a great time to check your work. If you have an ohm meter, you can check the resistance of each wire before you install it. Simply connect the meter to the wire terminals and confirm the wire has about 40 to 50 ohms per foot of wire. A 36 inch wire should show 120 to 150 ohms. Now install the spark plug side of the wire. Then move to the distributor side of the wire and repeat for all cylinders. A great addition to your new custom wires is the MSD plug wire routing kit. The kit is made with non-conducting material which prevents ignition crossfire and locates the wires away from heat sources like headers that could burn through your wires. Custom MSD plug wires and the MSD plug wire routing kit will cure a lot of problems in a stock ignition system and prevent you from getting left on the side of the road.